Hey everyone, Technoman here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix a frozen, stuck, or unresponsive Android or Samsung phone. So let's get started. Now, usually if it's frozen or stuck, there's a couple of things. First thing is if you have a case, you want to remove it. If you have a temper glass, you also want to remove that as well, especially if you put a new one or if it got damaged. Sometimes the temper glass on it can interfere with the touch itself being it frozen. Now, after you did all that, you want to go ahead and try to wipe it down cleanly. Take a microfiber cloth like the one here. Not too, just make sure there's no dust, oil, or any kind of grime. Basically, anything that could be interfering with that touch from not working. You want to make sure it's absolutely cleaned. Now, after you have done that, unless it's still not responding, you want to do this step, which is going to be the most important step. You're going to locate the power button and then the volume down button. And we need to press and hold both of the buttons at the same time, just like that, until the screen goes completely black. It's going to maybe say that, but don't do anything. Just keep on holding it. We're going to completely force it to shut down and then wait for the phone logo to appear before we let go. So we're going to wait here wait until we see something and then once we see we let go again sometimes it takes even like 20 30 40 seconds even up to a minute until you're holding down for it to completely shut down and then it goes completely black and it turns back on basically reloads the code it's almost like a forced restart which basically shuts everything down reloads it so if it's a software related glitch or bug most likely why it is it's gonna go ahead and fix your phone and from there on should be good to go so follow these steps in your Android phone that's been frozen stuck should be fixed and I hope this video is helpful so please consider a like and subscribe button we'll see you guys next time